y'all. Welcome back to my kitchen. I'm so glad you could join me today. With all the coronavirus fears that's going around, it's just getting hard to find supplies. I went to the grocery store the other day ago and they were pert near sewed out of toilet paper. Can you imagine that? Well, I have no problems here on the farm because my husband has fixed me up real good. Let me show you what he has put in my bathroom. My very own bidet complete with a scrub brush. Julie, eat your heart out. Thanks, Gary. Not only is my husband a man of many talents, he's also, oh my, one of the most compassionate people you'll ever meet. And he's been worried about me on the road. I put an awful lot of miles on my car. I drive from the farm up to the library, then from the library over to dialysis where I pick up daddy. I have to pick up Jesse from school, drop everyone off safely, go back to work, and then at the end of the day, I go over the river and down through the woods, back to the farm. And that's a lot of miles on my car. And with the coronavirus causing shortages all over the world, Gary's been sweet enough to prepare me my very own emergency preparedness kit for my car. What's in this kit, you ask? Let me show you. Shop towels, breaking parts cleaner for that extra fresh feeling, and sandpaper for those difficult to get at parts with a soft and gentle side on the back. I'm ready. Tonight, I thought we would explore air fryer accessories. I've ordered an accessory kit and I can't wait for you to unbox it with me. I'm so excited about this. It says right here on the top of the box, it says FDA, so it's Food and Drug Administration approved. It's all supposed to be safe. Air fryer accessories, family air fryer. Single people, I think you can still use this, but you're just gonna have to pretend that you're cooking for more than one person. Lose the fat, not the flavor. 80% less fat compared to conventional frying. Wow, it's only 70 something percent with a regular air fryer. Great British design, innovation, and an excellence since 1912. And then on the very back, it says it's new and it's made in China. So it's probably not British and it's probably not FDA and it may even be used and we won't know till we find out. But there's a picture of, what is that? It's not quite fish, it's not quite chicken. I wonder if it's a hybrid combination of it. I don't know even if you can buy that at the store, but there's some kind of fried fishy chicken thing with french fries and lettuce, because we always put our fish right on top of a bed of lettuce if it's fried. All right, here comes the fun part. Now we're gonna open it up. And it opens up. There's some little flaps. Facebook and Twitter and hey, I am telling you all about this on Facebook. So apparently you're supposed to tweet your fishy chicken things And once we do that, there's some flaps and the very first thing that I see is an air fryer recipe guide And on the back it says should you have any problem our friendly customer service staff is here to help you There's an owner's manual on here air fryer recipe book air fryer Recipes manual. Okay, y'all, right here. Well, there's not even an E in that. It's R C C E S S or Cursories. And it says it's new, but I don't know. The back of it looks pretty beat up and dirty. I hope it's not used. Okay, so it's got pictures in here of the air fryer. And it is telling me how to use the air fryer. It's got some recipes. There's fried chicken. There's hot wings. This looks exactly the same as the picture from my air fryer recipe book that came with the air fryer. Mozzarella sticks, garlic knots, a stromboli, coconut shrimp, bacon wrapped tater tots, a beef roll up, chicken tenders, beef empanadas, roast turkey breast, Roasted chicken with herbs. I should turn this around where you can see it. Spring rolls, a donut bread pudding. Ooh, I'm gonna try that one. Fried peanuts. They must have known that this would be sent to the south. Lamb chops. Grilled corn, which I am gonna do in an upcoming video. 
and fried pork wonton. This must be accessory number one. Now, in the box, I see all sorts of things. What are these? Oh boy, let's see. Here's another one. I've got two spatulas. I've got a flat spatula. And I've got a curved one for scooping out things. I guess you can drum with them. You can scratch your head with them. They're tiny. They've got tiny handles. Okay, some people call these pot liquors. I call them spatulas. And let's see, right in here we have a very, oh, the plastic bag came off. We have a very colorful set of useless, oh my God, these are useless measuring spoons. Okay, one milliliter, 2.5 milliliter, five milliliter, 7.5 milliliter, and 15 milliliter because anything that's being sold in the United States, we all cook by milliliters. What a joke. All right, now let's get into the nitty gritty part. All right, let's fix the pull up. I've got a lovely package. Lots of lovely plastic to kill my environment. Lots of plastic. We have what this is. Getting it off is the problem. We have a toast rack, which I specifically bought this for this doodad. And no, I am not going to be making, well, I may make toast with it, but no, the recipe I have in mind does not involve toast. And then we have a kebab grill where I can do kebabs. It's got the little skewers and you rest the skewers up here. Well, I should set all this out, shouldn't I? Then we have more accessories. We have the tongs. The tong. tongs, tongs, tongs. Whisk, whisk, whisk. That's actually a pretty good looking little whisk here. Ha ha, let's get it out of the plastic. Ba -da -da, da -da -da. We have ha ha, tongs that work. Ha ha. So let it be cooked. So let it be eaten. What's next? Oh, we have, let's open it up. Open, open, open. Scrapers. Scrapers and cake thingies to scrape the edges of your cake. Oh boy. I actually didn't have any of these. I have no clue if they're supposed to be stiff or they're supposed to be flexible. But hey, it came with the accessory kit. We don't need no stinking plastics. Now, there is a piece of cardboard in here that we can recycle. Don't you need any stinky plastics. Oh my God, this is better than Christmas. Y'all look, this is better than Christmas. We also have ah, a second pack of these things that are just like this. Yes, okay. What is this in the side? I'm gonna turn it up where you can see it. So now we have things and we're gonna go for these side things. Okay, all right, these are the things from the side and these are, let me get it out, let me get it out. supposed to be silicon fingertip pot holders but my mind is running through possibilities but I could see Liz or Jamie turning these into puppets put them down Crystal let's get on to the rest of the box Woo. <laughs> and now we have that looks like a flower. Crinkly thing. Oh wow, it's got its own little booklet. Look, it's got its own little booklet. How to make Starbucks. <laughs> I can't make this stuff up, y'all. How to make, it's not even legitimate Starbucks. 
It's ripoff. Starbusks. Sea bead egg bites in your instant pot. No, I didn't buy an instant pot. I bought an air fryer. And they've misspelled instructions. Your spinach egg and cheese breakfast bites. Special spinach onion egg and cheese breakfast bites. I don't see how that's a special from the other one just because it's got onion in it. Egg? No, they both have egg. Does this count as one of the accessories? I have a silicone thing for cooking. And it looks like a flower. You can cook eggs or cupcakes in here. And then here's a little lid to keep everything nice and fresh so you can take it to work and, and ask Jamie and Kelly and Judith and Laura and Rosie to eat it. And they'll say, you're trying to make me fat. Now to the next item. You ready? Da 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 da! <gasps> My very own air fryer cauldron! Ooh, for Halloween. No, it's cake pan. Now I could do a cake in an air fryer. Daddy, I've been promising you I would do a cake. Look what. All right, and I'm running out of space to put all this. All right. The silicone trivet. These are awesome. You can never have enough of these. All right, last item, I hope. No, it's not the last item. Oh my God. So here's a little tiny tray, a little metal tray for pizza. Yay. Wait a minute, I gotta go in deep. There's one item left. Ha! Ah, it is some parchment paper, circular parchment paper with air holes, which you can't really see most of the holes, just that one hole, but trust me, there are holes in here. And I think there is supposed to be a hundred of these in here. And I don't think that I mentioned this one in my zeal to pull things out. There's a rack that I can sit things on top of my air fryer. I guess the next thing is we need to figure out the air fryer if it even fits in the air fryer. And look, they fit in here with room around them. Yay, that would have been awful. They all fit. I hope. Man, that would have been awful buying these things if they didn't fit. There you have it. There's over 20 air fryer accessories. I'm so excited about all of this. I'll be using most of these in my next video, except for these things. These things are pretty useless. I have to use them for something else besides cooking. Milliliters. Thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to click like or comment. That lets me know you're out there watching it in quarantine land. And if you buy an accessory kit of your own, here's a friendly reminder to recycle the cardboard and the plastic. Let's do our part to reduce, reuse, and recycle and help keep America and Tennessee beautiful. Good wishes, good health, and good night. In this kit, Mr. Gary has given me a roll of shop towels in case I have no toilet paper can a bright cleaner so that I can make sure <laughs> I can't say that I have two packs of them I can't do this joke this joke is terrible this is a terrible joke I can just see it now I'll come to story time as Johnny Apple Air Fryer C Fry this. <laughs> I can't see it. <laughs> I can't see it. There seems to be a hole in this box. A hole. I've got a hole for me pocket. Ooh. What can you do with half a hole? I'll fix it to keep my mind from wondering. <gasps> it's a silicone. I wish it was a hole from Yellow Submarine. I can't do this without laughing. Back in here. And then I gotta start picking up some stuff. And with measuring spoons like this, I could, dare I say it, rule the world. Oh, no. No, these are useless. It, see, they don't convert. 
it, it, they don't convert to American. It, it, maybe if I had a nice British measuring spoon or a German measure spoon. See, these things are from China. I can't use them. They say milliliters and grams, 15 grams. <sighs> Sorry. I guess I need a grant for new measuring spoons. <laughs> I can't say that. <laughs> mm -mm. <laughs> And it says it's an air fryer accessories for a family air fryer. So single people, I don't think you're going to get to use this. Or if you do use it, please don't tell the government. A roll of shop towels in the event of no toilet paper. A can, a brick cleaner to make sure that I'm well. <laughs> I can't say that. too silly. <laughs> <laughs>